The homeless problem is very obvious around Mirror Lake in St. Petersburg. During the day, people can be spotted all around the banks. But Pinellas County just received $4 million from the federal government to help homeless people move into permanent housing. As you know, we have families who might be living in a motel or individuals living in a motel who can pay their weekly uh, rent at the motel, but they just don't have the resources to get into housing. The money would help pay for first and last month rents and utility deposits. It's a start, it'll get some people out. And that would be a big help. This homeless man who didn't want us to use his name said it would make a difference in a lot of lives. It'd be a great help because once you get shelter, permanent shelter, that you know that you can go home to, then it's easier for you to obtain a job and, and keep a job because you've got some stability. Another homeless man who didn't want to go on camera told me he and his fiance have been looking for this kind of help for weeks. I think that they, they need to do something because they need to, to get these people off the streets. And, and help the homeless, and help the homeless, and help who actually is out there that wants help and needs help. Homeless advocates admit the $4 million alone won't solve the problem, but the Housing First program is certainly a step in the right direction. But this is a new strategy, and the recognition is we've needed a new strategy because numbers of homeless haven't been decreasing, not just in this community, but, but nationally, which